Well, we have uh, some awesome news regarding VSTS and Azure environments. Uh, what we have, uh, we can now uh, perform automated testing on Azure environments. And how can we do that? Uh, imagine that we can deploy or update testing environments using release tasks. So there's a new task called Azure Resource Group Deployment, which I can do some things using resource, uh, a resource group inside, uh, inside Azure. So you must be using a service endpoint uh, uh, from Azure Resource Manager type. So it's a connection type, uh, Azure Resource Manager. And with this already configured in your team project, you can use this task called Azure Resource Group Deployment. So you can use both resource, Azure Resource Manager or Azure Classic connection type. So but with Azure Classic, we can we do not have uh, all the options we're going to have to with our earlier uh, connection type. So let's switch to Azure Resource Manager connection type. Once I choose this connection type, I have to choose my RM subscription, Azure Resource Manager subscription. Uh, and now I can choose between one of these actions. So let's take a look on all the action we now have. We can create our update resource group. We can select a resource group already, uh, an already existing resource group. We can start, stop, restart, uh, and delete virtual machines inside these resource groups. And we can already also delete resource groups, right? And if we want to create our update resource group, we can give it a name choose the location and use a template which needs to be inside an artifact with uh, which is inside the linked build of this release okay uh, these templates uh, defines a, a resource group which may contain virtual machines once uh, once you put your mouse over the eye beside the template you have some help options here and two links one to get started with azure templates and one to have uh, a sample template so this is this is a template the template basically have some definitions of your azure resource groups and a powershell to uh, to call the configuration of it so we're not going to talk about these templates but you can select one of it from your liquid build artifact okay and once you have it here configured what is the plus here you you may put your resource group inside a variable a build variable and you can use it in this this other task called run functional tests so you can use azure virtual machine or azure environments to run your functional tests so you basically put your machine names using fully qualified domain names or the, the, the variable that has the, the, the resource group and you, you inform the drop location of the tests and finally you choose your test parameters. It's not the scope of this video but you can figure which test do you want to run on this release okay so once you have it you're able to run your automated tests using azure environment that's the, the that's the objective of this feature deployed on the last sprint uh, 